In this video, I'm going to show you how to export an Elementor template kit. If you have an Elementor website, you can export it as a template kit, which you can import onto a new website to start designing with. This is a website I've designed with Elementor, and I want to have the same design for a different website, maybe with some little customizations. So this is what I'm going to teach you how to do in this tutorial so that you're able to export your Elementor website which you can import onto a new website. But we are not going to be covering the importation part in this tutorial. I have a link in the description that will show you how you can import your Elementor website. So if this is what you want, keep watching. Hello guys, this is Sadiq here at Tickle Pages Web where I do web tutorials just like this one. So if you are new here, consider subscribing. That's it. Let's jump into the video. So to export my website as a template kit, I go over to the back end of my website. Then I go over to Elementor then I click on settings. Under Elementor settings, I click on experiments. Going down to import export template kit, I drop down the arrow and choose active. I go down, click on save changes. Next, I go over to tools. Then I click on import slash export kit. In here, I have two options that is export a template kit and import a template kit. For this tutorial, we are going to look at how to export a template kit. So I go ahead and click on start export. In here, you need to make sure that all what you want to export will be selected. So if I don't want to export templates, I can deselect it like this. Take note that you may not be able to export templates if you don't have Elementor Pro. Even if templates is selected, your templates will not be exported as part of your template kit. That is if you don't have Elementor Pro. As part of my template kit, I'll have the website content that is Elementor pages, landing pages, Elementor posts, WordPress pages, WordPress posts, as well as custom post type. I'll also have the size setting that is global colors, global fonts, theme style, and what have you. Also take notice that the size settings you'll be getting should come from the size settings you have done inside Elementor. Next, you can choose your kit information by entering the name for your template kit and also give it a description down here. I've entered my kit name and description. Next, I go ahead and click on export. And it is setting up my kit. From this dialog box, I go ahead and click on OK to save my template kit. So my template kit is saved. I click on back to dashboard. So with this template kit, I can go ahead and import it and start customizing it for a new website. So that's it on how to export an Elementor template kit. I hope this video was helpful. If you found value, kindly hit the like button, subscribe and also enable the notification bell so that you miss out on future videos. Keep watching and I'll see you in the next one.